Seven of Hearts could go there. You think I didn't know that, B? I'm just trying to see what else I can do first. Absolutely not. We owe it to the tenants. We don't owe them diddly, and we're certainly not going to get a new washer when the old one's doing just fine. It's starting to eat people's clothes. How's the stove coming? <sighs> it, it, it's done. You know that defunct washing machine? Huh? Can you fix that? Well, it wouldn't be the first time. That settles it. No new appliances. So I, uh, I put a new clamp and a new hose. But if the pilot light ever goes out again, you should give me a call. Okay, dear. Yes? Hi, I think this might have fell out of your window. Well, well, well. Come on in. And there's, what's his name? The man who sold the building to father. Larry Dawson. Dawson. Scoundrel and con artist. Oh, help yourself to some candies, Nicholas. Oh, yeah. Humbugs! God, I haven't seen these since I was, like, uh... They're my favorites, too. <laughs> mm. Who's the soldier? Oh, that's my fiancé. Oh, it was my fiancé. Pauline, Harold didn't propose to you. He was about to. No, he proposed to me. So, uh, where's Harold now? He went and got himself killed, liberating France. Well, this has been really nice. So thank you so much. Um, but I, I should go. Thank you for coming. I'll show you to the door. Is she okay? Oh, she's just fine. She's got the constitution of an ox. See yourself out. I'll get you an aspirin. The other Miss Dubois told me that you wanted a new one. Oh, Beatrice! 
this. B, since when did we decide to buy a new washer? B. Hello. Where have you been? I just went over to see Eunice. Eunice? And how is she? Oh, she's fine. Amazing you got back so fast, considering she's in Palm Springs. I meant to say Doris. Time for our afternoon naps. Yes, it is. Very on yourself. So very on yourself. Washing machine like you asked. That nice young man in 214. He's a lawyer, isn't he? Tom? Huh? Yeah. He uh, he does immigration and stuff. Oh, thank you. I guess I should go to work. It might be drafty out there without pants. What did my sister want? Sister? Oh. Don't buffalo me. I know where you live. I own where you live. She asked about the guy in 214, the lawyer. That's all I know. Thank you. I know what you're up to, talking to that lawyer. You're trying to sell the building behind my back. What nonsense? Why would I do that? Oh, knock it off, B. You've wanted to sell this place for the past 20 years. I'm not trying to sell this building, you old fool. I'm trying to put things right, get my will in order, fix things up so it's not a constant headache for you all the time. Don't you mean us? No. I meant you. I'm dying, Pauline. What? I went to see the specialist yesterday. I, I need a new ticker. That's my age. There's no way I'm going to get one. Don't be ridiculous. Everyone needs a new ticker at our age. Wouldn't you know I've had a bum heart all these years? The valves just flap away like linens on a clothesline. Well, we'll get another opinion. I have. I'm sorry, Pauline. It's only a matter of time. No. 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 Oh. I know it's hard to hear. Our entire lives, you've gone first. First to lose a tooth. First kiss. First boyfriend. First to lose your cherry. First in mother's heart. I'm the oldest. It was supposed to be me. Pauline, don't do this to yourself. Well, you're not going to get away with it again. I'm dying first. Pauline, I'm dying first. Get down from there. <laughs> I 
Should I call 
cup might be. Oh, I like the look of that one. Excellent choice. That's the Copper Cameo. Lavender tinted concrete exterior with customized nameplate. Reinforced high impact corrosion resistant liner. <laughs> corrosion resistant? Oh, yes, that's very important. Thank heavens the coffin will stay in one piece while your putrefied remains are being feasted upon by maggots. Just pretend she isn't here. I want to be cremated. Put me in a shoebox and bury me. It's what's above the ground that counts. Agreed. Shall we talk about your options for a memorial service? I want the full meal deal. St. James Cathedral. I have the psalmist for the organist right here. Pauline, St. James holds 500 people. If the church relied on seat sales, it'd go bust. Everyone we know is either senile or dead. Well, you know what they say. It's not quantity, but quality. We can definitely arrange St. James. I see you and your sister have side-by-side -side plots. What about transportation? I assume you want matching monuments. Oh, a simple marker will be just fine. Fancy coffin, simple marker, it makes no earthly sense. She's just trying to be contrary. I'll pick something up for us both. No, no, no. Give me that map. Is there a plot available over here? Yes, but that's nowhere near your sister. Perfect, I'll take it. Beatrice Dubois! Don't you, Beatrice Dubois, me. I'm fed up to the back teeth with you always getting what you want. My whole life has been the Pauline show starring Pauline. Oh, that's rich. My whole life you've hogged everything from me. Every opportunity I had, you'd sneak up behind me and try to grab it from me. Hogwash. You just couldn't stand the fact that once in a while people chose me over you. And you always made me feel guilty about it. If you felt guilty, it's because you were guilty. Yes, I'm guilty. Guilty of putting up with you all these years. If, if we could discuss flowers. And now I'm dying and, and you're doing your best to make me feel guilty about that too. Like it's all part of my evil plan. I'm gonna die just so I can show you up. If I could just get a deposit. Get out. Flowers. Get out! Did I drift off again? I guess I better go to my room. I don't want you to go. You're my life. And you're mine. I don't want to be left behind.
You know, you really did look good in that chiffon dress. Thank you. Oh, Harold. He really did like you best, you know. No. He liked you. There we are at the peony. Remember the agricultural building? That handsome young cowboy flirted with you.